Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm diving into a topic that's as intriguing as it is important, narcissist fear triggers. Understanding what triggers a narcissist's fear can be crucial in navigating relationships with them, whether at work, in friendships, or even in family settings. So grab a seat and let's uncover the top seven things that can make a narcissist feel threatened. First up is loss of control. Narcissists thrive on control. They need to feel they are the ones steering the ship. I remember a time when I was working on a project with a colleague who displayed strong narcissistic traits. Whenever I voiced my ideas, he'd shoot them down. But the moment I took the lead on a task he felt he should control, he completely unraveled. His need to dominate that role was so strong that it triggered all sorts of defensive behavior. This can come off as aggression or criticizing unprovoked. The fear of losing that grip led him to try and manipulate the situation even more. The second fear trigger is criticism or feedback. Narcissists often have a fragile self-esteem masked by bravado. If you've ever tried to give constructive feedback to someone with narcissistic traits, you might have noticed a withdrawn silence or an outright explosion. I remember during a performance review, I needed to address some areas where a narcissistic coworker could improve. The moment I began to speak, the air thickened. Instead of discussing the points, he completely deflected them, turning the conversation back on me. This fear of being exposed as less than perfect is a huge trigger. Coming in hot at number three is being outshined. Narcissists relish being the center of attention. So when they're upstaged, whether it's by someone else's success, charisma, or talents, watch out. I recall attending a networking event where a narcissistic acquaintance's gaze shifted between his own attempts to impress and others' accomplishments. You could practically see the steam coming from his ears. The need to be best leads them to lash out as they're terrified of being perceived as inferior. Our fourth trigger is emotional vulnerability. Narcissists often project confidence, but deep down, they fear being exposed emotionally. Let's think back to a time when a friend confided feelings about their childhood, the typical trust scenario. The narcissist in the group was visibly uncomfortable and quickly changed the subject, perhaps even mocking the vulnerability instead. Emotional exposure is a big threat to them. It's not just about discomfort, it's a major fear of being seen as weak. Number five is rejection. The fear of abandonment and confirmation that they are unlovable is debilitating for narcissists. This might manifest in relationships where any sign of detachment or disagreement sends them into chaos. I've witnessed a friendship dissolve when one chose to step back for their mental health. The narcissist reacted with fury, asserting that they were the victim, as if the potential of being left behind was the ultimate blow to their self-image. Our sixth trigger is losing their audience. Narcissists thrive on admiration and applause. Take social media as an example. Many narcissists monitor their validation through likes and comments. When their posts don't receive the expected praise, they might behave desperately or resort to extreme measures to regain attention. I've seen this in action when a friend posted a picture that didn't get the usual likes. The ensuing behavior ranged from deleting the post to creating shock and awe content just to divert the gaze back to them. Finally, number seven, losing status. Narcissists wrap their identities around their status, be it career position or perceived power in their social circle. When threats arise, like competition or challenges that could diminish their image, a promotion snatched away, for instance, they often respond with hostility or schemes to undermine the competitor. I've seen a colleague become vindictive when a peer was promoted over him. The fear of losing that perceived climb shattered his intended image as the alpha in the office. Understanding these fear triggers can empower you in handling relationships with narcissists. It helps you anticipate their reactions and arm yourself with knowledge. If you found this video insightful, give it a thumbs up, share your experiences in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe for more content like this. I'll see you in the next video. Stay informed.